Hi, I'm John Bruchot from artvirtual.com, and in this video I'd like to briefly demonstrate some of the features and functionality that you'll find in the new Architectural Beginners Kit 2 that we specifically tailored for architects and designers that are using the Unity game development engine for architecture and design visualization. In order to find the project, go to artvirtual.com and do a search for Beginners Kit 2 and you'll find on the site a link to a demo where you'll see all the different functions in action and a link where you can download it and purchase the kit so that you can incorporate it into your own projects. This is the demo scene. In here you'll notice that the mouse look works a little differently than it did in the first kit. You no longer have to hit escape or the L key uh, in order to free up your mouse to click on the buttons. Instead when you want to go into mouse look you click on and hold your left mouse button and when you want to click on a button you just release and then you can click into the into the button so it's a little bit more um, fluid and intuitive that way um, on the top you'll find switch scene uh, this is a really powerful feature uh, that enables you to have multiple models in your uh, unity project and then load them into individual scenes and then call those scenes up by clicking on a button so you might have several different design iterations of a project that you're working on instead of having them all side by side in the same scene you can now uh, divide them up um, if they were all in the same scene you would have a lot of polygons you'd be generating a lot of draw calls and it would really have a negative impact on your performance um, but if you uh, divide the project up into different scenes you're only rendering what you want to see at that given moment uh, so that really helps um, for design iteration um, and you know even having different material uh, assignments uh, and things like that. So I've got two different scenes, design option one, just for demonstration purposes, and then I've got design option, um, design option one and two are included in the kit. Um, switching camera views, um, this is, uh, all it is is it enables you to set up multiple camera views in your scene and then switch to those different camera views by clicking on these buttons. So right now we're in the first person uh, kind of traditional perspective view, but sometimes you want, um, you know, those orthogonal views like the plan view, um, which looks like that, and you use the arrow keys can actually pan around. Uh, we've got a side view, a front elevation. Um, so that's kind of useful to be able to just get a, a, a sense of the design uh, through those more traditional views. Then we have waypoints, and waypoints are simply um, different assigned destinations within the scene. So you could have, if you've got different highlighted areas like an auditorium uh, or a lobby space or something that you want to feature, you just assign a waypoint to each one of those, and then when the user clicks on that, uh, they're taken right to that destination. Um, so here I am in the interior. If I click on exterior, then I'm brought out to the exterior waypoint. I also have a quality toggle, and um, it's pretty self-explanatory, but it's actually a very useful um, tool because if you're on a, a lower-end machine and you're getting some lag, uh, all you have to do is decrease the quality a little bit, uh, and, or, and you'll get a little bit smoother experience with hopefully less lag. Um, the only thing that'll affect is the texture quality and the shadow quality might decrease a little bit. Uh, you can customize all that inside the Unity Editor. Um, likewise, if you're on a really high-end machine, you can uh, increase the quality so that it looks great and you get those really nice, um, crisp textures and shadows. Um, so that's it. Um, if you have any ideas for functions that you'd like to see built into future kits, just send an email to info at artvirtual.com. So that, that's it. Thanks and enjoy.